Hi everyone, my name is Jenny and I am Lakeland University's on-campus yoga instructor. Today we are so pleased to bring you a flow that is going to focus on heart openers. So go ahead and get in something comfortable, pull out a mat, and we're going to start right away laying all the way on our backs. Allow your legs to go out fully in front of you. Spine connects to the mat, shoulders connect to the mat. And right away, goal post the arms, bend at the elbows, palms are gonna shine up towards the ceiling. And just feel this shoulder opening, heart opening space. Your back body is connected to the earth, the skull is connected to the earth. The backs of the legs are connected. And just breathe into this beautiful heart opener as we start our practice today. It doesn't matter the speed or pace of the inhales or the exhales, just allow them to flow naturally through you. If you'd like, you can even start to deepen the breath, maybe to a count of three or four, and just allow that wave to wash over you. And start to do a check-in with your heart. As silly as that may sound, how is it feeling today? Is it heavy? Is it light? Is your heartbeat frantic? Or is it slow and steady? How is your heart in this very moment? As you lay here, completely supported by the earth, eyes are closed, how does your heart feel? Know that if you feel a heaviness, you can change that sensation with your breath. And with this beautiful practice of yoga, breathing, intentionally focusing on your heart and seeing if you can let go. Feel free to set an intention and dedication for your practice here. It might be a word, a mantra that's true to you. I am strong. I am loved. We'll seal our intention with one collective breath. Inhale through the nose, fill up. Open mouth, exhale, side out. Let that intention manifest. Slowly flutter the eyes open and start to move the fingers, maybe extending the arms long to a T, maybe even overhead. Toes can point out in front of you, big morning stretch. And then hug the knees in towards center and rock side to side, maybe drawing circles on the ceiling with your knees clockwise or counterclockwise. And then gently flipping the direction of the knees. Allow the knees to steady. Arms again are gonna go out to a goal post or to a T and drop both knees to the right. Gaze to the left. Spinal twist. The heart is still opening here as the shoulders connect. The half, the lower half of the body is gently twisting. Inhale, allow the knees to rise back to center. Exhale, drop them over towards the left. Gaze to the right, shoulders ground, heart open. Deep breath in through your nose. Open mouth, exhale, release. Lift the head and then the knees back to center. And start to rock the length of your spine. Coming up to a seated position. 
Inhale, reach the arms tall overhead, relax the shoulders down the back, sit bones ground down. Exhale, right hand will plant towards the right hip. You can even stay tall on the fingertips. Left fingertips reach. Exhale, left hand over towards the right side. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, half cactus, opening through this left side. Inhale, length. Exhale, half cactus. One more. Inhale, length, lift. Maybe your gaze starts to lift. Exhale, half cactus. Allow both hands to reach tall overhead. Exhale, left hand down, steeple through the fingers or release to the palm. Right fingers reach. Exhale, right arm goes to the left. Start with the hand reaching tall. And then exhale, bend the elbow, half cactus. Two more times together. Inhale, reach. Exhale, half cactus. One more. Inhale, reach. Exhale, half cactus. Both arms reach tall overhead. Exhale, full cactus. Both arms spread, heart open. Shoulders, blades together down the back, palms facing forward. Inhale, length, lift. Maybe your gaze floats up. Exhale, cactus. One more together. Inhale, length. Exhale, cactus. Allow the hands to reach tall overhead. Crawl the hands forward, coming into tabletop, hands and knee. Moving through cow and cat. Inhale, cow pose, drop the belly and hold here. Feel your heart opening. Palms are flat. Maybe the tops of the feet connect down to the mat. And then exhale, press the floor, curl the spine and breathe here for just two rounds of breath. Inhale, cow pose, drop the belly, lift the gaze. Exhale, cat. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Two more rounds. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Last round. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Return to a neutral spine, hands and knees, tabletop. And we're gonna come to rock onto the right knee. So if you'd like, you can step the left toes back and then position the right foot out to the side as you come to rest on this right knee, left hand reaches tall. Feel your heart opening towards the side wall. Take a deep breath in. Exhale here. If you'd like, you can inhale Utita, flip the top arm up and over the face. Breathe here. Another option, if you'd like, you can bend the knee, collect the foot, really feel that heart opening space. If you took the bind, gently release the foot, returning back to tabletop. Take your time moving to the opposite side. The right toes can step back as you position the left knee to the side and then roll out, open up. Feel your heart reaching. Inhale, Utida, if you'd like, flip the top arm up and over the face. Breathe one long line of energy from the fingers to the toes. Or if you'd like a half bind, grab the foot or the ankle and feel the heart opening space. Gently release without slingshotting. Foot connects back down. Hands and knees, tabletop. Gently plant the hands, curl the toes. Downward facing dog, first time here. Pedal, walk the dog. 
bend your knees if you have tight calves, hamstrings, palms connected to the earth. And then find some stillness in your down dog. Breathe here, two rounds of breath. Inhale your gaze forward between the thumbs. Exhale, travel to the top. Inhale, halfway lift, Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale, fold, rig dial, grab for opposite elbows, allow the head, the neck, the shoulders to hang. If you'd like, heart opening, chest expansion, interlace the hands, the low back, hug the palms of the hands together. If you'd like, you can even put a towel or blanket between them to extend the arms. Take one more inhale. Exhale, release the hands down. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Grounding through the feet, mountain pose, Tadasana, rise up. Exhale, cactus the arms, open through the heart. Inhale, mountain pose, Tadasana. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift, Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale, fold. Ground down through the feet. Inhale, mountain pose, rise up. Exhale, cactus. Inhale, mountain. Maybe the gaze lifts. Exhale, fold forward, Uttanasana. One more time through the mini sun A. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Mountain pose, Tadasana, rise up. Exhale, cactus, and stay here. Maybe hug the shoulder blades a little bit together down the back. Or if you'd like, you can even extend the arms long back. Another option, chest expansion. Hands at the low back, rinse them down. Gaze up if it feels comfortable in the neck. Whatever you've chosen, Exhale, release, reach the fingers tall. And exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant the hands, step it back to a high plank. Breathe here for one round of breath. Exhale, downward facing dog. Two breaths, home base, reset. Inhale, reach the right toes high to the sky, three-legged downward facing dog. Bend your left knee if you need to for a little bit of extra space. Exhale, low lunge. Step the right foot between the hands. Inhale, warrior one, spiral that back foot, that left foot down pair to a 45 degree angle. As you inhale, reach the fingertips tall. Feel this warrior one space. Gentle flex in the front knee. And then exhale, hands drop either to the sides or to the low back. Stay here breathing, reaching the heart forward. Or if you'd like, humble warrior hinging at the hips, diving inside of the front right knee. Allow the right hip to hug in instead of jet out. Two rounds of breath. Inhale, gently release, take your time, coming back up, warrior one. Exhale, frame the front foot, step the left foot back, find that low lunge space, and then melt the left knee down. Coming up to a grounded crescent lunge, hands can rest on top of the right knee, they can reach tall, up overhead. Or exhale, cactus the arms. Another variation, interlace the hands, the low back, rinse it down and bend maybe a little bit more into the front knee. Gently release the hands, inhale, rise up. Hands reach tall. 
exhale, hands plant, frame the front foot, curl the back toes, and gently step back, downward facing dog, two breaths, reset. Inhale your left toes high, bend your right knee if you need a little extra space. Exhale, low lunge, foot between the hands as we set up for warrior one. Back foot steps in, 45 degree angle, reach the fingertips tall overhead and breathe here. Hands reaching high, shoulders squaring forward, gentle flex in the front, left knee. And then exhale, either cactus the arms, hands at the sides, or interlace the hands at the low back. Stay here and breathe. Or if humble warrior is calling you into the posture, go ahead, hinge up the hips, coming into humble warrior. Invite the left hip in instead of out. Gently release the hands, inhale up, warrior one. Exhale, hands plant, step the right foot back, finding that grounded lunge, allow the right knee to plant on the mat, hands framing the front left foot, walking tall, reaching the hands high. Keep the hands lifted, cactus through the arms, or interlace them at the low back and bend into the front left knee. If you have the bind at the low back, release the fingers tall overhead. Exhale, frame the front foot. Curl the back toes under, finding downward facing dog. Allow the knees to hit the mat and come to stand on the knees, setting up for camel pose. Keep the feet flat or you can curl the toes under. Imagine you have little pockets in the backs of your yoga pants as you hug the elbows together, reach the heart forward. Press the hips forward on an imaginary wall. Exhale, allow the head to rise first, and then the hips sink back, hero's pose. Just for a moment, if this is too much, too intense, you can stay lifted. Take one deep breath in. Open up, exhale. Sitting over to one side and swaying the legs forward, laying all the way down on the back. Hug the knees in. Feel free to rock side to side. Massage that lumbar, that low back. Setting up for another back bending space, bridge pose. Soles of the feet plant. Hands come along the sides. Palms down. Pressing into the feet. Inhale, reach the hips up. Keep the head, the gaze up towards the ceiling to protect the neck. If you'd like, you can interlace the hands at the low back, rinsing them down. Feel that heart space shining up. Your belly rising and falling with breath. Exhale, release the bind. Gently articulate the spine down. Supta Baddha Konasana is our reverse. Soles of the feet come together. Knees split out wide like a book or reverse knees knock together, feet to the wide edges of the mat. Whatever leg variation you are in, allow your left hand to your heart, your right hand to your belly. And just breathe here. Feel your heart beating in your chest oxygen flowing in and out. And feel the beautiful rhythm 
of your heartbeat. It's unique to you. That life force energy that is coursing through you. And show yourself some appreciation for showing up and practicing today. Feel free to stay here or if you'd like, enter in full Shavasana, releasing the hands to the side, the legs go out long and release. We'll be here for at least three to five breaths. But if you need a longer Shavasana, know you can pause the video and come out of Shavasana at your own pace. start to bring some awareness back to your breath, moving the fingers and the toes, rocking the head side to side. Arms reach tall overhead, legs, toes point out in front of you. Exhale, hug the knees into the chest and roll to the left or right side into a fetal pose, pausing with one hand on the earth, the other is a pillow. Eyes closed, head heavy. Allow your hands to help guide you up to a comfortable seat. Allow the hands to come together at heart center. We'll seal this beautiful heart opening practice with one community breath. Inhale through the nose, fill up. Open mouth, exhale, release. Thumbs to third eye, that space between your eyebrows. May the moments of your life be filled with peace, joy, and love. Namaste. Thank you all so much for joining me today. I hope you were all well and healthy. And until next time, thank you so much.